Oh, welcome to Georgeville Nissan. Oh, hey, how you doing, man? Good. Name's Damani. What's your name? My name's Mitchell. Nice, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, too. What brings you in today? Let's check out this new Frontier you got here. Gotcha. You got any questions about it? Uh, actually, you got a lot of questions. I really don't know much about it. Okay. So, it does have the 17 alloy wheels. Okay. Um, it does have the new boomerang headlights. Um, the new body style that they had just made for the 2022 is actually from changing that from the older one. Okay. Um, it does have a V6 motor in it. Nice. Very light and powerful. Um, it has liquid cooled motor mounts. That really helps drive. Um, it helps drive a lot smoother on the freeway and roads for you. Perfect. I um, love that. The old ones kind of drove funny. Yeah, they're, they're a little, little bumpy. Rough. Yep. Um, it does have the new uh, body style, like I said before. They did redesign that a little bit. Um, it's got the new tail lights. Oh, what do they look like? Uh, they're kind of blue out and master. Oh, nice. A little, little sleekier. I like that, uh, the red on here. Oh, yeah. It really pops. Buckeye thing? Yeah, I would say so. Um, it does have the backup camera. Oh, nice. Right here? Yep. Perfect. And then they do, they, Nissan did make the new uh, logo. I'm a big fan of your logo. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's nice. And then the um, tailgate. You can actually let it go on its own and it stops like that. And it Perfect. goes down a little bit slower. Nice. I know my old truck, it just falls right down yep this one's a lot safer it does have the hooks in there so if you're new you to haul anything you can hook it up um higher models do have lights um it is four-wheel drive nice i don't know if you're a kind of off-road kind of guy a little off-roading exactly so here is the inside of the frontier so it does have pull down seats with your tire change equipment back here um, and they do fold up from the bottom with more a little bit more storage space um, get this back down does it have the same thing on this side yes it does well uh, how do i lift the seat up so there you do it from here oh right over here oh, oh okay yeah i didn't see that it pulls it up from there you oh, got a little oh, bit oh, more storage very nice very nice Oh, uh, just right over here on the yes, same sir. on the yes, same spot. Oh, yeah, oh, that's good. very smooth, very smooth transition. And then you do have your middle cup holders. Oh, dang! My truck does not have these in the back. Yeah, this uh, makes it nice for people rolling in the back. And then uh, you got your USB ports back here. Also, it does have the new style phones and the old style. Okay. Um, you got your carpet flooring. Nice. Um, you can get all weather mats for it. Okay. Okay. Um, I'm looking forward to that, for sure. And that is all for the back. All right. So in front of the fronts here. On the uh, driver and passenger side, we do have, you know, we have your uh, USB ports again. And uh, what are what are those used for? Uh, you can use them for an Apple CarPlay and an Android Auto. You can also use them to charge your phone, and it'll all display on this eight-inch color touchscreen. Um, you Very do nice. have what you say? Very nice. Very nice. Yes. Um, and then you have your glove department. Uh, you have your middle compartment. It does come with two cigarette lighters. Can I only light my cigarettes with that or can I use them? You can actually use it as a charging port also. Okay, Does, do those come with the car? They do not. Okay, okay. Then it does have cup holders in both doors. It has cup holders in the middle. Um, depending on if you want to pay for it, you do get Sirius XM. You have your FM, your Do I get that AM. for free at any point? Uh, I think you get it for the first three months. Okay, okay. And then you can run Bluetooth from your phone also if you don't want to use Apple CarPlay. Um, you do have your four-wheel drive, two-wheel drive, and you can do that on the fly from stopping to 60 mile an hour. Nice. Oh, so if you like to go off-road, it's perfect. Back Snowy back. conditions, super rainy conditions, swap it in four high, four low, whichever. Um, and then it does have the um, 360 safety shield on it. Okay. So you do have... Um, The intelligent forward collision warning. Okay. Um, you also have the automatic emergency braking. Mm -hmm. um, and you can do all of that on here with the switch of a button. Click through that. Okay, so this right here is uh, like my settings, and I can go, what are like yep, the so driver assist? Yep, so you can go over to the left, keep scrolling. Shows your tire pressure, your driving aids, and it has your blind spot lane. Um, shows you your fuel economy. 
um, than your other gauges and things like that. Um, what else? Okay, my off-road, you know, power distribution. That's that's pretty cool. Shows you your speedometer digitally. Okay, okay. it's pretty cool. And then where where is my blind spot located in the truck? Your blind spot is located um, right on the uh, driver's side mirror. Oh, right, right up there in the corner. Yep, right top left. Oh, okay, okay. Is that is that on both sides? Yes, and that's on the top right also. Oh, yes. okay, okay, cool. I need to know where that's at. You know, I don't want to hit nobody while right, I'm out driving. Right, right. This is a big vehicle, you know. Um, you have all your air vents up here. Um, here is control the lights for the cab lights. Uh, got your mirrors. And yeah. Very nice, very nice. You have any other questions about it? Uh, how many how many cup holders you say I had again? Uh, I believe total. Uh, yeah, yeah. I know. Just in the front. Uh, in the front, you have four. I have four in the front. Wow, that's four beers I can take with me. That sounds nice. <laughs> Legally. Legally. <laughs> Yeah, well, here, let's, let's go inside. I want to know how much this thing is. All right. 